Hey everyone, I'm going to be pulling some cards, see what we get, what's coming in for you guys. My name is Crystal. You got deep knowing, exchanging gifts, and thinker. Wow. And then clean it up. I feel like this is all like spiritual talk right here. Deep knowing, exchanging gifts, thinker. I feel like you guys are very intuitive. Somebody, you might even be psychic. You might be somebody who like, share, you know, exchanges like your readings for other people's readings. Or just, I feel like you guys help other people in exchange for other things. It doesn't always have to be for exchange. You could just, I know us as healers don't always do that. We just do it for free sometimes. But then you got clean it up. I feel like you guys are um, realizing something that doesn't belong in your life anymore. It's like, it's time for you guys to get rid of it, right? You got the Tower and the Nine of Pentacles. I feel like things are falling apart. And it's like, you guys are ready to be by yourself or ready to be just like focused on yourself. Uh, this is about self growth. So I feel like you learned a lot with this tower card, right? I feel like everything that you had um, built has finally came crashing down. And it's like, you know, now you're trying to rebuild yourself. And I feel like you're remaining strong through this. Um, you had the five of swords and the six of pentacles. I feel like you gave yourself too much or you gave yourself too much or you you gave your energy too much to other people who didn't deserve it. Your time, your money, it doesn't matter. But whatever you were giving to other people, they weren't giving it back to you. The Five of Swords, I do feel like there's some struggle here. So it's like a challenge within. Maybe you feel like you're never good enough. Or maybe you feel like you um can never win, right? But I feel like it's because you're too giving and you're too caring with other people's feelings when they don't care about yours. So I feel like you just need to, um you know, work on that a little bit. And um, not really keep on helping those who don't help you back. You got the Four of Cups which is saying maybe you're feeling like blocked or ignored from somebody or maybe you feel like you missed out on an opportunity um just know that rejection is god's protection so whatever that has to do with you have the empress which is like and the empress the nine of pentacles and the star these are all about like self-healing self-work taking care of yourself using your creativity self-growth okay this is about balance and alignment and really like um trying to like heal and focus on like you right just taking care of you so i feel like whatever came crashing down it had to come crashing down because i feel like you needed to take care of yourself maybe you were taking care of too many other people and maybe you really needed to be focused on yourself the chariot the ten of wands and the fool <laughs> wow okay so in the middle of these two cards are the ten of wands it's like these burdens are about to be put down you got the chariot and the fool on both sides of these and this is telling me that you're ready to leave this both these cards are about moving and leaving this might be maybe moving to another state or maybe moving in with another person or maybe somebody's moving into your household something like this maybe you're getting a new car i don't know but whatever it is i feel like this is forward movement towards success when you do leave though with the ten of wands when you put down these burdens with the chariot card there might be people that are jealous of you because you're trying to move on right and so it might be like a relationship that you're trying to move on or maybe like you're doing better with yourself and maybe it's just like friends are going to be jealous of you. I don't know what it is, but I feel like you're going to be fine. Okay. You worry too much about other people. This is time to focus on yourself. The Ten of Cups and the Strength card. Yeah. Focus on your family. Focus on your happily ever. You're happily ever and remain strong. Okay. Don't keep on giving in to those who don't give in to you. You have one, two, three, four, five, six major arcanas and like... I don't know how to count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 12. So 50%. So this is major. And it all has to deal with healing and leaving and moving on from the past, moving on to the future in a better way. The Seven of Cups, don't let the um, confusion you know, stop you. You have the death card too, which just fell out, which is like death and rebirth. So I feel like you have multiple options. Just make sure you choose wisely. Take your time. Okay, no need to rush. I feel like you're doing a good job, and this also, you might be going through like the dark night of the soul, because I feel like a lot of healing, you're, you're helping a lot of people, so maybe you're a healer, maybe you give too much of your energy away when you shouldn't, right? So what's coming in? The two of swords, there's a decision that needs to be made, the hierophant, something that you're committed to, or something that you really know that you need to do, but you're fighting within yourself with the five of wands. But when you make that decision with the Queen of Pentacles, the Five of Cups, and the Magician, and the King of Cups in the bottom of the deck, I feel like there's going to be a loss, but, you know, I feel like you're going to get your power back. You're going to be able to take care of yourself. Your money's going to get better. Um, you know, I feel like your magic and your abilities are going to increase, and you're going to be, look, the King of Cups and the Queen of Cups in the bottom of the deck. So I feel like there could be a new love, a new um, partner coming in for you, like a soulmate, a soul connection. Um, or your relationship might be getting stronger if this is, you know, so anyway, that's what I got for you guys. If you guys like my con, if you guys like my content, please like and subscribe. Alrighty. I just saw the devil too. So 
Let's see. What what is the good things that's coming in for you? The Ten of Cups. Happy life, okay? Knight of Swords. It's coming in fast. And the Empress. And the Seven of Pentacles. Something that you're going to be able to build on. Yep, but you got to walk away from something else, whatever this is, first. Okay? So, thank you for watching. Toodles, guys.